Yo, what's up guys, it's me, it's me, it's Action Figure Freak and after a while it's time again for the Anime Heroes figure line. This week I got you another member of the Straw Hat Gang in form of the Tony Tony Chopper from, yeah, One Piece. So let's just dive right into this. We got the Tony Chopper out of the box and as you can see in comparison to my hands, it's a pretty small figure compared to the others, but he got a lot of, let me just change the camera direction, a lot of accessories and what I've never seen, oops, missed one, what I've never seen on these anime heroes is this which just fell out of the box. It's a whole description page just about using those accessories. So that is really, really awesome. And I would say let's just first look at the articulation and then going over to the detail and accessories. Uh, so yeah, let's just start. Those joints will be a little difficult to understand. Let's see if I can pop off the head. No, can't. Uh, maybe I can. I just don't want to try. But it will probably be the same as on the arms and legs just one dot uh, one problem with the articulation is his head as you can see it's always going on to his arms but it's maybe just in that pose uh, do we have swivels nah it's just dual molded we don't have swivels here uh, the arms are yeah normally dotted. You can move them around a little bit, but not too much to the sides because yeah, after a little bit they probably will pop out. So it did the first two to three times when I tried it. Then we have the legs. I'm not sure if you can move that thing here. It, it doesn't feel like you can move it, uh, but it looks like it's supposed to make him more like into a sitting position to make that a little bit easier uh, or just for putting the legs into the front more for stop motions and stuff but he looks so cute so let's just go over to the accessories it's kind of part of the articulation on that figure uh, then into the detail first up I would say let's switch out the face and this is pretty easy, just pull the head to the back, go under his chin, pull that back, and then you can slide it out. Pretty easy, isn't it? Uh, so let's just go onto the mad face, pop that in, see if that's as easy as popping it out. Okay, it isn't. Oh, it is. Pretty easy, as you can see, looks still cute as hell. Let's just go on to the arms, let's switch these out to some normal ones. Okay, like this. And, uh, wrong one. Yeah, this one. Okay. Let's see if I can fit it right there. Uh, it's a little bit hard, let me skip that. Here we got the arms in. They're not marked or anything, so I think as they look, they're pretty much identical, uh, so it's not really important which arms you put on which side. So yeah, then let's just do the next face. Uh, come on. Whoop. That one. Most happy star eyes. Okay, you can't really see that so good on the camera. Uh, the colors don't transition that good, but it's not really important. I'm just happy they included it. It's awesome. And now, let me just do what everyone wants to see. Oh no! Don't do this to me! i comfortable! Cute ass, cute ass embarrassed face of him. Really like it. I had a lot of issues pulling that arm into there. Uh, but... I'm not sure if it's related to go on the right or if the left gap is just a little bit stuck. Uh, but yeah, and if you were uncomfortable with uh, 
his head going over the arms, you're really gonna get angry on that point. We got two more accessories for the first one of the two. We gotta detach his arms. It's his pretty cute backpack, which is yeah, pretty well made, I would say. Let me just come on, yeah, here, get some focus on it. It's a pretty good mold they use in there. Uh, you just slide it over his back, I think. Yes, like this. And then reattach the arms. I'm gonna go with the first ones again. Come on, like this. Now let's see if I got joint issues here. It's probably like that. Ugh. Yeah, a little bit, a little stiff. So yeah, then he got his little cute backpack, like there. We have one more thing left, and it's that clear plastic thing. Because I think you can stand him up pretty well. Probably. Uh, can I? Yeah, kinda, kinda. It will work, but if you put it on your shelf like this and it's about two meters high and it will fall down, man, I think it's gonna break. And that would be sad, so they included this, where you just slide the feet in. As you can see, then you can lean him back so you can see the face better. And yeah, it should, it should go. Shouldn't probably lean him back like that. More like this. But yeah, it's working perfectly. Now to the detailing part, and I think it's really, really awesome what they did on such a small figure. Uh, the faces, we got a 3 out of 2 with an opened mouth, which is awesome. Really like that. Uh, we got things like his uh, broken off uh, horn here. Uh, that metal piece on there. It's also in, in here. We got that... Yeah, mold here on his head, which is awesome that they molded all these red pieces in there and everything out of here is molded. So you really can see, uh, yeah, some overlapping here. Uh, also, as I've shown you on the back, they they really, really tried to make it look uh, like in the anime, uh, even even his hands. They included the paws on everywhere uh, and even the shirt if you if you can hear it It's molded. It's molded. I mean, yeah, it's painted over, but it's molded. I really love that It gives so much more depth into the figures and this one in a rating 1 to 10 <laughs> I would say I would give this figure a solid, <laughs> probably a 7 out of 10, or a 7.5 out of 10. It's such an awesome figure, I really fell in love with this. Uh, but the one big issue is, it's an action figure. And you have these arm problems. For stop motions, this can be a big problem, but whatever. I mean, all in all, it looks good. I, I'm, I'm sure I'm gonna give it an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. It's such a cute figure and it's so on point. I mean, there are a few anime heroes figures where I'm a little disappointed, like the Naruto in the, in the frog mode, I would say. It's just the classic Shippuden uh, Naruto figure uh, with just eye makeup, not even special outfit or anything it's just uh, wasted but this is really a new mold they've seen it's such a small figure for the regular price they, they really got to do something about it and they did something and it's awesome it's really awesome i really like it so yeah i hope you liked the video of today and i think uh, we'll see you again at friday on sunday so goodbye for now